But yo guys, today I'm going to show you how to get macros on Fortnite and like a pro like this. So, first step, you're going to go to the Soul Series GG app, which you should get once you've got the keyboard. Once you've come to the app, on the left hand side, it's going to say Home, Quick Set, Sonar. You're going to go down to the Engine button, press on Engine, then it'll come up with the keyboard that you have connected to your PC. So, you're going to press on the keyboard. Here's Apex Pro Mini, so I'm going to press on mine. Then on the left hand side, it's going to say Config 1, Config 2, Config 3, Config 4, and Config 5. You want to use whatever config you have not used before. If you have used all of them, you're going to have to reset it in the bottom right. It says revert. So I'm going to use config 3. So once you've pressed on the config you haven't used before, it's going to come up here. Key binds, dual binds, dual action, meta binds, settings. You want to go to key binds and you can see your own keyboard here. Then on the left hand side, you're going to see macro editor. You're going to press launch here. I'm going to clear this because I've already done it before. So once you see this screen, guys, you've got to press start in the bottom right. So now you've got to choose whatever button you use to edit in Fortnite, for example mine is V, you're going to press the edit button. And then whatever your select edit button is, for example mine is the right side of the mouse, you're going to press that button, then you're going to press stop, just like that. So, first MS, you're going to put whatever your ping is in Fortnite, creative, anything. I'm going to put 5, the lower the better pretty much, but if you go too low it just won't work. So I'm going to do 5. If you have good ping, I recommend 5 to 10. If you have worse ping, I say 10 to 15. So once you've done five, um, next it's going to have a number. You're going to change that to whatever, two, two to three, less than the first number. So I'm going to do three. And then again, on the second one here, I'm going to do three. So then you press save here. And then once you've saved that, you can minimize that tab or you can close out of it. And then you're going to come back to this screen. Next, here are all the key binds. So whatever button you want the macro to be, for example, mine's J, you can put yours to V, U, T, S, anything. You're going to press on it. So I'm going to do... J. So once you press on it, it should come up like here. At the top for you guys, it will be default. So you're going to click on default and you're going to do macros and it should say key press macro 1. So you're going to press on key, key press macro 1. You're going to click on it just like that, just like so. And at the bottom it will say play once. You want to change that to repeat while pressed. And then at the bottom will say the MS. You want to change that to 3MS. So once you've changed the 3MS, you want to press done. And then always at the bottom right guys press save if you don't press save it won't work and then you guys will be commenting why is it not working it's because you haven't pressed save so then just like that that's how you get macros in fortnite here's my new 1v1 zero delay map as you can see i'm on zero ping and still recording literally this map guys i have the code in the description soon if you're the 1v1 your friends got the reset button it's got everything you need guys look at the sun over there but yeah that's how you do it guys thank you